Time for the big one in the derby, the most important race in the world. I don't care what everybody else says. Mile and a half, Group 1, three-year-olds. Albus Dumbledore, Dan Hughes, Altitude, Munas, Bad Manners, David Robertson, Fighting Edge, Paul Parsons, Kinda Magic, Jim Murray, Kyber Pass, Paul Rhodes, Meshfi, Ryan, Dan Hughes, Paladin Straits, Jai Bermanstein, Shaw Grease, James Shea, Swinging Groom and the White Knight for Martin Lidham, Time of the Beast, Joshua Sutherland, Trap Miles, Darren Thompson, Tunbridge Wells, Paul Rhodes and Wassily Kandinsky for Leon Van Rensburg. So 15 then, that's one of the smallest fields of the day so far. The rain is coming down. Well, it's not going to dampen anybody's enthusiasm. They're installed and ready to go in the derby. I don't know where they go then. And it's a pretty level sort of break. Who's going to be the first one to take it up? Looks like the White Knight, the Grey, might be interested in the lead. Also, Time of the Beast is up there as well. And Kind of Magic Albus Dumbledore, another Grey, is to the fore as well. We've got three Greys in this. But it's Time of the Beast who's gone off into the lead. And Joshua Sutherland is going to be open for a repeat performance from what we've just seen from Heart of Oak in the Oaks because Time of the Beast is clearing the lead by four or five lengths, lengths just like his stable companion was in the previous race. Wassily Kandinsky, wide on the track, is second, then Fighting Edge and Swinging Groom. Kind of magic is after that one. Paladin Straits is in that little group as well, looking towards the back. Altitude and Bad Manners at the back two with Trap Miles and Sean Griggs also towards the rear of the field. But it's Time of the Beast who leads there inside the final mile already. Fighting Edge is in second for Paul Parsons, giving him a good thrill of a season, getting a runner in the derby in his first season. Where Sidney Kandinsky is third, then comes Swinging Groom after that. Paladin Straits is next, then Kyber Pass coming through as well. But it's this leader is Time of the Beast, who leads by a good four length, bowling along in front. The rest are quite happy to let him stay in the lead, it would seem. Fighting Edge is holding second, then Wassily Kandinsky and Kyber Pass, and then Paladin Straits, Tombridge Wells is now trying to come through with a run round the outside. Also, Kind of Magic is wide on the track. Swinging Groom is tucked in with them. Albus Dumbledore is trying to get into it as well. But it's Time of the Beast who's still in the lead from Albus Dumbledore who comes through into second. Then Tunbridge Wells and Paladin Straits. These four now being joined by Meshfi Ryan who's coming through. They're the lead in five. After that one, Fighting Edge. Kind of Magic. Wassily Kandinsky under pressure. Kind of a pass with work to do. I think we can probably forget the rest. Although there is a James Shea on out the back there that could probably finish quite well it's time of the beast in the lead two and a half furlongs to go in the derby and it's time of the beast from Tunbridge Wells in second Albus Dumbledore and Meshvi Ryan the two greys then Wassily Kandinsky and Paladin Straits fighting edges keeping on they're inside the final furlong and a half now and it's time of the beast who's still in the lead by two and a half lengths to Albus Dumbledore and Tunbridge Wells then Meshvi Ryan Wassily Kandinsky they're not catching this leader they're inside the final furlong is Joshua Southern going to do the Oaks derby double it's time of the beast who's clear and they're not going to catch him. Time of the Beast is going to take the derby up towards the line. Pillar of the post win for Time of the Beast. Time of the Beast wins the derby. Tunbridge Wells is second. Short Grease then. Bad Manners finished well as well. The White Knight was probably last. And Joshua Sutherland does the derby. Oaks double. And he's surely going to be the flat champion trainer this season. Can he do the double and win it in the national order as well? But Time of the Beast... Time of the Sutherland is what it is, and Time of the Beast takes it pretty comfortably. Second was Tunbridge Wells for Paul Rhodes, placed again in a classic for Paul Rhodes. Short Grease for James Shea, run on Waterby third. Kind of Magic Jim Murray fourth, and Bad Manners for David Robertson was fifth. <laughs>